It's CEO here, and in the 2.0.4 patch update, Nintendo sneakily added 11 brand new items. Now, Nintendo said there are no more major updates, but they didn't say there's no more minor updates, so there's definitely a possibility we'll be getting more minor updates that introduce new items, like the one that just happened. So in this video, I'll go over all the new items that were added in this update and show you how to get them. But before we jump into the video, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and click the bell button to get notified when I post more videos. Also like this video if you're excited for new items. Doing all those things really helps support the channel and lets me keep making these videos for you. Now let's get into it. The 11 items you see here are brand new Zodiac items. Each one of these figurines corresponds to one of the Chinese Zodiac animals. Depending on the year you're born, you're assigned one of these animals. I put a link in the description so you can find out your own Zodiac sign. All the figurines you see here will last the entire lifespan of New Horizons, so no matter which animal you are, you'll be sure to be able to get a Zodiac figurine to match your own sign. The way the Chinese Zodiac works is that every 12 years, you're a specific sign. So for example, here is the boar, which corresponds to the years 2019, 2007, 1995, 1983, and so on, going back 12 years each period. So the most recent year that the boar corresponds with is 2019. Even if you just know one year that the Zodiac figurine corresponds to, you can easily subtract or add 12 years to get your birth year to figure out which animal corresponds with your birth year. Now these little Zodiac figurines are not new to New Horizons. We already have an ox that corresponds to the year 2021 and a tiger figurine that corresponds to the year 2022. So it makes sense that the Nintendo went ahead and added figurines for the rest of the years to make sure every player born in every year has a figurine that corresponds to them. In addition to the ox and tiger figurines, we now have the boar figurine, the rat figurine, the rabbit figurine, the dragon figurine, the snake figurine, the horse figurine, the sheep figurine, the monkey figurine, the rooster figurine, the cat figurine, and the pig figurine. I love how cute these are, Nintendo did a really good job. I especially like the dragon one back there, I think it's the best looking one, and its bright green color really stands out from the rest of them. I'm just so happy to see Nintendo added all the rest of the figurines, because I was slightly worried how Nintendo would handle these yearly items, items that correspond to different years. There are some other items, like the balloon arch that corresponds to the incoming year. Right now we only have 2021 and 2022. So I'm not sure how Nintendo will handle that. I'm curious to see if they'll add the rest of those balloon arch years in another sneaky update. The switch date time only goes to 2060, so I'm curious if Nintendo will add balloon arches that go up to 2060. That'd be a lot of different items to create, but honestly, I would love if they do that. Also, if you're curious, I'm the year of the rat, so this rat figurine is one I'll definitely be eyeing because it's my animal. And I'm curious to know what Chinese Zodiac you are. So let me know in the comments which animal you are, and also if you don't know which animal, check out the link I linked in the description to find out your own Zodiac animal depending on the year you were born. So if you're looking to get your own Zodiac figurine once you figure out which animal you are, you will need to time travel to each year to get them. Once you time travel to the appropriate year, you can pick up these items in Nook Shopping under Special Goods in the Seasonal tab. As you can see here, I have all the New Year's items, and if you scroll all the way down, there is the Zodiac Tiger figurine that corresponds to the year 2022. You can even get a little information about it if you press X. So because this figurine corresponds to the year 2022, if you go to the next year, you'll be able to get the figurine that corresponds to that year, and so on and so forth until the end of time. So to get these items in-game without any external help, you will need to time travel to each year. In the seasonal tab is the only way to buy these items. This does involve time traveling many years in the future, so I understand if you don't want to do that because that could mess up your island and give you a lot of weeds. So you're in luck because I have all these zodiac figurines on my treasure island and you're free to take them. My treasure island is open during my Twitch live streams, which are Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 6 p.m. Pacific time. All my YouTube members and Twitch subscribers also get 24-7 access to my treasure islands, which means you'll be able to pick these items up at any time of the year, no matter what, and you won't have to time travel. If you're interested in becoming a YouTube member, I've linked it above and in the description. I hope this video helps. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.